Hey guys, greetings from sunny Sorrento. I kind of can't believe that I'm filming a video in a bathing suit. I feel like a complete weirdo, but that's kind of the point of this video. So I'm here in Sorrento, Italy. We're on holiday. I know you probably haven't heard from me in a while, but this is why. This is where I am. I love it here. You guys know that we come back like every single year. So I wanted to talk a little bit about how I lost the baby weight, but more importantly, I wanted to touch on body confidence. This is why I'm making this video in a bathing suit. I'm four months, I'm almost five months postpartum now and I've lost all of the baby weight and I've talked about that before. I obviously think that breastfeeding helps a whole lot, but alongside that, I didn't do anything drastic and I think that's really important not to do anything crazy or drastic especially just once you've had a baby because if you are breastfeeding you don't want your milk supply to dry up at everything in moderation i didn't cut calories i didn't try to cut out different food groups i didn't do any crazy amount of exercise you guys know if you watch our daily vlogs i don't i don't claim to be some kind of big fitness person and i i don't want to be what really helped me was my fit bug which i'm still wearing right now and that definitely helped me just like to keep track of things so if i do things around the house not necessarily like a big workout or anything like that just vacuuming or walking around this tracks your steps so it helped to keep me motivated that way. I didn't really track my whole, like all of my calories the whole entire time. What I used it more for was tracking things like sweets or, you know, if I'm having something bad, maybe I'll have like this option rather than this one because this one might be like 300 calories and this one might be 500. And you can use your Fitbug for that because you can put in, you know, you can type in I don't know if you're like out at a certain restaurant, you can type in that restaurant, you can see their calories. For example, here in Sorrento, I'm eating dessert like every single day, but what I do is I try and just limit it to one. Here at breakfast this morning, they had such amazing pastries, but I know that I want ice cream tonight, so I had fruit instead. So it's all about balance and moderation. I try to eat like fruit or porridge or something healthy in the morning, a salad or like healthy sandwich in, the middle of the day, like for, for lunch. I ate whatever I wanted for dinner. I just kept it to like, I watched my portion sizes. So like here in Sorrento, I'm eating pasta every day. That's all right. I am still breastfeeding, like I said, so that burns obviously like 500 calories a day. For my fitness, what I did very, very simply was just tracked my steps with my Fitbug, like I said, throughout the day. I didn't do any crazy workouts, but I did do like some light strength training. So usually after I put Eduardo down to bed, I would do a couple of sit-ups, maybe some leg lifts, some lunges, just really, really simple stuff. And that's all I did. Drink lots and lots of water. That will obviously help your milk supply as well if you are breastfeeding. And that is pretty much it. When I went shopping for bathing suits this year, I am obviously the most self-conscious about my belly button area because that's the part where I have like stretch marks and the most kind of sagginess. So I got a high-waisted bikini just to feel more comfortable with that area and that's kind of what this is all about. So I want you guys to either upload a picture on Instagram or Twitter or Facebook or whatever you want and use the hashtag I love my bikini body because everybody should love their bikini bodies no matter how imperfect or I don't know how flabby or how many stretch marks you have. It really doesn't matter. I can honestly stand here and say that even though my body was probably better before I had two babies, I'm way more confident about my whole body image now after having two than before. So it really has nothing to do with that. It's, it's not about how perfect your body is. It's just about how you feel inside. So I want you guys to do that. I want you guys to upload pictures of yourselves in your bikini. I don't care if you're at your goal weight or not, or like how you feel comfortable with how you look. Upload the picture, hashtag I love my bikini body. And I think we should just create a whole movement because it's life is just too short to be spent feeling unhappy about our bodies. So I hope you guys will join me on this. This is scary, but I think it's gonna be worth it. So thank you for watching this video and I will talk to you in my next one. Bye.